anything and everything. Do you ever wonder how to? Do you ever wonder why? About anything and everything. Then Doris is your guy. Anything and everything will open your mind. Anything and everything with Doris. Anything and everything with Doris is online. Remember. Remember. Anything and everything with Doris. Hello, everyone. You are listening to the Anything and Everything podcast, and I'm your host, Doris. This episode is brought to you by McNeese Construction. This week, I'd like to take a few moments and go over cataract prevention. This past week, a very dear friend of mine had cataract surgery on his second eye. I realize it's not a very big deal to many, but if you can avoid any type of surgery, then wouldn't you do so? For those not familiar with what a cataract is, it is the gradual clouding of the lens inside the eye which decreases your vision and can lead to blindness. It's similar to looking through a window of fog. While many believe it is an inevitable part of aging, there are natural interventions that can be used to slow down or possibly reverse the progression. So here are a few tips I've found on how to prevent cataracts. Number one, avoid cholesterol-lowering statin drugs. From two decades of research, it has been recognized that statin drugs have the potential to cause the progressive clouding over the lens of the eye. Furthermore, studies have shown that when taken alone or with other drugs which inhibit their metabolism, the drugs increase the risk of cataracts of those patients. One reason for this is due to the catarogenic potential of these drugs being able to push systematic distribution throughout the body and passing through the blood-brain barrier, entering the cortical region of the lens, producing damage. Number two, curcumin or turmeric extract. This is an amazing plant that aids in so much, including protecting against the development of cataracts. Many of the compounds in turmeric can help counteract the lifestyle and other health factors that can promote cataracts and may even help stop or limit their formation. This includes supporting cardiovascular health, controlling blood sugar levels, and boosting liver function, which integrative medicine experts also suggest can also keep your eyes healthy. Further studies also show that the anti-aging effects of calorie restriction, which some of the compounds in turmeric mimic, can help delay the formation of cataracts. Number three, lutein. During a two-year double-blind placebo-controlled study, lutein was found to have improved visual function in patients with age-related cataracts. You can find lutein in foods such as dark leafy greens, green peas, squash, pumpkin, Brussels sprouts, broccoli, carrots, and egg yolks. Number four, wheatgrass. A study published by Biogerontology in 2005 notes that wheatgrass may actually reverse lens opacity associated with cataracts. You can check out that study below in the references. Number five, Ultraviolet light can hasten the formation of cataracts. So, is it any wonder why they ask you to wear UVA or UVB protective sunglasses? And number six, stop smoking, guys. Did you know that smoking increases your risk of developing cataracts? And guess what else does? Alcohol consumption. So limit your alcohol intake as well. To learn more about these studies, check out the references below in the show notes. There are hundreds of foods, herbs, and spices that aid in the prevention of premature aging, including the eyes. By learning how to incorporate these into our daily diet, we can prevent many ailments along the way. For example, did you know you can add turmeric, black pepper, and garlic to a shaker? Shake it up real well and use this blend on eggs in the morning or any other meal. 
Turmeric also aids in inflammation that causes arthritis, but as all herbs and spices do, it aids in other areas as well, including eye health. You can take supplements, but the most effective way of keeping well is by eating fresh ingredients whenever possible. By doing so, we get better tasting meals with all the great health benefits to keep us moving better. And that's a win-win if I don't say so myself. And that's our show. Thanks for listening. And until we meet again, enjoy every day to its fullest. And God bless. Mm -hmm.